Hello everyone and welcome to today's episode of Cooking for Gamers. We're doing a little special one today because uh, it's in honor of the release of Skull and Bones. Well, technically it's still in early access, but by the time this video is out, it's gonna be completely released at least. Anyway, we are gonna be making a recipe that is inside the game. It doesn't mean that it comes from the game because the, the recipes are actually authentic recipes from all over the world. There's lots of different ones from, from different regions of the world, depending on who was active in the piracy world. The game takes place in the Indian Ocean, so basically that's the region of you know activity that we're looking at which means not the caribbean but the indian ocean this recipe specifically is an indonesian dish and it's called uh satay kambing originally it's supposed to have goat meat to be authentic it's basically like these skewers right like meat skewers but originally you would use it with goat meat otherwise you might replace it with lamb i was going for lamb i went to the store and i even looked out like exactly what i wanted and everything with lamb steak and everything but it was freaking out they were sold out so I had to compromise. We ended up taking some beef. I could have gone for chicken. I don't know. I just went for beef. Uh, surprisingly excited about Skull and Bones. Enjoyed the beta test a lot. Me too, honestly. Really, really excited. I've been enjoying the game a lot as well, so um, I don't know. It's gonna be exciting to play it. Anyway, what was I gonna say? I was gonna say that for the recipe, we need the meat, which is supposed to be lamb, but we're doing beef at the moment. Or it's supposed to be goat demon. Can't find goat here, as far as I know. Ketchup manis, ma manis and uh, garlic. Lots of garlic. It says six garlic cloves. We'll see. Um, uh, they're saying satay space spices. I don't know what that is. So, um, I didn't really find anything like that in the store. So, not sure what we're gonna do on that front. And then we got lime juice, lime juice, and that is basically it. This is a sponsor stream by by uh, Ubisoft, and the recipe comes from the game. The game has an Indonesian recipe, which is uh, satay kambing, and that is what we're cooking. Satay spices are just a name group of sweet spices like curry, coriander, cumin, tandoori. Well, I actually have some of them because I, I got a bunch of uh, spices from India. So that means we got cumin, we've got coriander, we've got uh, turmeric. We've actually got fresh coriander as well. We're totally going to use this. And that's what you need for the skewers. Then for the peanut sauce, we need peanut. We've got three little kefir lime leaves here. We've got some, some brown sugar, some sambal oelic, but we're not going to take too much because it's pretty spicy and we cannot really deal with spiciness here. Anyway, and then we're going to be serving it with some boiled, um, also, yeah, with that is obviously sea salt and lime. Sorry, forgot to say that. And we've also got green beans and rice to serve it with. So, let's get started. Let's get started. Let's start with marinating. I don't know how much you need, but I don't even know what this tastes like, if I'm going to be completely honest. A sweet soy sauce for Asian cooking. No clue how much we need, but we are not going to dump it all, chat. No, 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 no. Also, um... Yum, 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 yum. We need to cut up the beef. Cut the beef up. I'm gonna marinate it in a little thing my bob here. I think I might actually cut it a little bit over here. I'm also gonna put it on a plate thing in my bob. And since we're doing rig beef, we're not gonna be scared of making the pieces kind of big because if we do, it means that we can uh, make them a bit bloody, a bit red on the inside. Since it's actually pretty nice meat. I have no idea what the amount is because I can't, it says in cups, so I don't know. Half a cup? I mean, how much is half a cup? I have no fr freaking idea. We're just gonna have a go. But considering the amount isn't really coming out very much, I don't think we're gonna be swimming in the sauce at least. What's the worst thing that can happen? That it probably doesn't taste great. This is me spanking your butt chat when you're not behaving. <laughs> anyway, okay, we're gonna press some lime. I think we're gonna use half now for this and then half later for um, the sauce. This is half a lime. I don't know, you could probably sh smash a shit ton of more lime. Anyway, next step. Garlic. We need a shit ton of garlic. All right, go some garlic over here. Do, 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 do. Is this, yeah, it fit. It's so big, I didn't think it would fit. Garlic tip, crush it as lightly with a knife. Oh yeah, people have been telling me that, but I keep forgetting that. Maybe one day I will remember it. What did chat tell me to do? Now, what do we need? Hot pepper, we're just gonna take regular black pepper, not a hot pepper, and some salt. Boom, boom. Now we need to get these spices. We've got turmeric, turmeric. We've got some coriander. We're also gonna put some fresh coriander on this, I think. I'm thinking we might do that after or something. Some cumin. Do, 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 do. Okay, here we go. Now we're gonna let this meat sit for a little bit. While we do that, we are gonna start with the, um, with the, with the, with the peanut sauce, okay? And for that, we're gonna actually grind our spices. 
Boom. We're also supposed to fry them a little bit in a little bit of oil. Okay, so we're gonna put this here, right on the side. And first, we're gonna start by frying our peanuts a little bit. 200 grams of peanuts. 250. Okay, we can just take all of them. We are gonna fry some peanuts. We got unsalted peanuts. They need to be unsalted, okay? Or non-salted or natural or whatever you call it. And then it said two tablespoons of, of oil, but basically just said just enough to coat the peanuts. Perfect. They're coated. Haha. Dicky 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 dicky. We've got um, the peanuts that we're about to fry, waiting for it to get hot. And we've got the meat here sitting, waiting. Then we're gonna get the um, green beans and some rice as well. Turn the sauce, peanut sauce, into a sauce, and uh, then we're good to go. We're gonna fry it at eight, baby, so they don't completely burn. <laughs> they said to throw away the the burnt ones because if you don't, then uh, they will apparently taste bitter or something. Trying to get rid of all the burnt ones. All right, I think we're done with four to six minutes now. Let's get rid of any potential burns here. It's funny you keep digging around. You're like, oh, I found all of them now. Nope. Whoop. Whoop. Boom. Now we're gonna scoop up the peanuts with slotted slotted spoon and transfer to paper towel. I don't have a slotted spoon, but okay. We're gonna get rid of the excess fat, I think. Do 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 do. We're gonna need to do this in two rounds, I think. There's a lot of peanuts with a lot of fat. Do 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 to cool. Remove any bird pieces, they will taste better. Okay, they're supposed to cool down now, but I ain't got the time for that, do I? <laughs> now we're supposed to get these in here. Whoop. Nice. We did it. And then we're putting this one here and we're going to do this again with the rest of them. Do, 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 do. Boom. Next step in the peanut sauce. Blah, 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 blah. Grind them in the small food processor. Yes, yeah, that's what we're doing now. Cover your ears. It's silent. <laughs> I don't think it's silent because, yeah, the noise cake. Coarse sand. Yep, yeah, it's coarse sand now. That's what we wanted. Water, lime leaves. Tamarind, they don't have that, which means uh, lime. This is where we need the lime. Lime, water, sugar, and salt. Almost four deciliters of water. Okay, there we go. We need, need um, the leaves, putting the leaves in. Boop. Um, two tablespoons of dark sugar. This is a lot of sugar, okay. Oh well, if you say so. Sugar and uh, how much salt? Two teaspoons? Fine sea salt? Are you serious? Oh, teaspoon, not tablespoon. Oh, <laughs> I was like, what the heck are you kidding me? Because it was uh, tablespoons. I was like, what? Thank you. That's a lot more reasonable. Boom. Now we're going to all uh, melt this all. And then we're going to be adding sambal oil. Like, simmer for about five minutes, breaking up the tamarind pulp. Yeah, I don't have that. Bring it to boil over medium heat and then adjust heat until it's bubbling gently. All right. Okay, while we do that, we're going to move on to the, the beef thingies, I think. The skewers, I believe. Should we do that? Yes, we should do that. We're gonna get two of these things. I know you're supposed to have many small, I think, but we'll see. I think uh, um, we might only have enough for uh, uh, not that. <laughs> Here's the grinded uh, peanut butter, or uh, pe no, peanut, just peanuts. And here is the little juice thingy that we're making to mix it with. Now we're gonna uh, make the skewers. Oop. Okay, let's do this. Rig beef on skewers. Not every day I do this. Do 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 ba bum 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 There we go. Very good. Okay, now it says uh, remove the lime leaves. Uh yes, 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 yes. I remove the lime leaves. Mm, you can smell the lime leaves. <laughs> They uh, make a lot of flavor here, actually. Add the ground peanuts uh, and bring to a boil over medium high... Wait, oh, boil again? Okay. Boil again? We're now adding this in here. Add the ground peanuts and bring to a boil over medium high heat. Uh, adjust the heat to simmer gently until thick and creamy like gravy. Eight to ten minutes, stirring often so the sauce doesn't stick to the bottom of the pot. Okay, I think that we're gonna start making the rice now. We've got our rice cooker for that, of course. We're gonna do that over here. Actually, it's a multi-cooker, but I always use it to make rice as well. The question is, how much? We don't really need that much. We need like maybe two tablespoons. Two tablespoons. Oh my God, subsies. Thank and then you. wash, wash. <gasps> Dylan! Hi! Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Bring it up to a boil and then it said medium heat for 8 to 10 minutes. Whoop, 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 whoop. Do, do, do. 
Okay, now the rice is washed. Wash, wash. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, rice, boom, start. Rice is on the way. Peanut sauce is currently baking, I was gonna say. So I'm kind of sad that I uh, that I didn't actually film what it looked like from the start. But from the start, it looked like basically water. <laughs> and I was worried that this there's no way this is gonna work out. But now it's been simmering slash boiling for four minutes and it's already starting to look a bit thicker. As you can see, it's still very liquid, liquid, way too liquid for a sauce, but keeps getting thicker. And burr, 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 remove the heat and stir in sambal away like I need to taste this thing even because I don't even know if it tastes good. Wow! Holy! <laughs> don't put that in the YouTube video, editor. <laughs> Whoa! That is the goodest <laughs> mother <laughs> peanut sauce I've ever made. Holy! <laughs> okay, I'm never making peanut sauce any other way. Holy! <laughs> This is exactly the way that I've been trying. I've been trying to get a peanut sauce to be like this, but I, th oh my God. Sorry, sorry. I'm so sorry for screaming in your ears. I'm so sorry. I got very excited. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it was so good. Okay. Overexcited much? Yeah, I know. Okay, it's just that this is exactly what I wanted from a, from a, from a peanut sauce that I've been looking for, but I haven't been able to make it. Wow! I like you excited, but I also like my ears. Okay, sorry. Sorry, I also like your ears. <laughs> okay, I got a little, little bit too excited, chat. Um, <laughs> by the way, veggies. I realize now I should have gotten more. This is only 150 grams for the both of us. We're gonna be um, frying these somehow, somewhere, sometime. Also, we gotta get the um, lunch there. Now, we're gonna bring up the frying pan. We're gonna bring it, bring this one, which is like, got like these. <laughs> Whatever that's called. So that, um, you know, you get that nice kind of like pretend barbecue. I was gonna barbecue, but there's like a minor little hiccup chat, which is called cold, cold, very cold snow outside. That's my barbecue right there. I'm gonna pass on that. We're gonna very much pass on that. So, um, yeah, here we are inside instead. Did you moonwalk yet into this video? No. How much sambal oil should I have? How much did they say? One teaspoon. That's, that feels a little bit much. We're gonna start with a little bit. Okay, now let's turn off the peanut sauce. We're gonna get to frying. Bow, 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 bow. Boom. <laughs> this sauce is now the awesomest freaking awesome ever. Sorry, it's really a swear word or something. Ah, look at this. So good. It tastes even better. Now we're gonna fry those here. Okay, should we put some more sambal oelik? <laughs> it wasn't spicy. It before it goes to super spicy now. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Shit. They don't fit. God damn it, that. Okay, we need to, I don't know. I need to get one of these. Wait, wait, wait. I have a gardening tool. <laughs> we gotta improvise that. Okay, wait. Nice. There we go. Okay, we're good. Thanks, Frick, for gardening tools, okay? Oh, we need to boil the Boil fast, boost, put on boost, boil fast. I'm very excited for this actually. I think it's gonna be good, good, good. I think it's gonna be good, good, good in the hood, hood, hood. You also gotta get those going in here. And the cilantro chopped. I don't know where we're gonna put the cilantro though. Okay, um, I think everything is done. Boom. Do, 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 do. Let's see if we can do this. It worked! That was so easy. What was I fussing about? I don't even know. It just went out of there. We got the veggie. We've got this. I need a spoon. Where's the spoon? Here. We're gonna take one skewer of this. Boom. And now we're gonna scoop up the peanut sauce. And then we're gonna get some cilantro. Chat, this is turning out pretty damn nice, yo. Boop. And um, some cilantro. Chat, this is looking like a proper nice meal, you know? Like I'm an actual chef or something. <laughs> cilantro everywhere. <laughs> Very nice chat. You also need to add some salt on the beans, but here we go. Here is the finished result. I don't know which angle is best, but looks good, right? Here's Olaf's portion, which is significantly bigger because he's a hungry boy. Looks pretty good, right? Okay, where do we start? We start, we start with, we start, we start. Okay, we start here. Perfect. It's still red. Wait, 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 wait. I want to thank Ubisoft for sponsoring this video. Thank you so much. Pog! And see you in Skull and Bone. Mm -mm.
Mm. Now you demolish everything and mix it all up. Really? Should I? You know what? I probably should. You should also, also get these things off, which is funny. You like put them on a skewer and then what? Let me take them off the skewer. Demolishing it. Yeah. I think this may be a little bit too much peanut sauce because I think it's going to be swimming in peanut sauce here, but that's fine. The rice will absorb it. Okay, okay, okay. Absorb it. Mmm, 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 mmm. Uh, today's stream is planned, uh, well, obviously the cooking, and then we're going to play some skull and bone. This was a, an amazing recipe. Really, really good. Really, really, really good. <gasps> I almost forgot one thing. Almost forgot one thing, which is very important. I forgot how to do YouTube videos chat. Um, anyway, eh, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you did like the stream, no, it's not a stream, the video. If you like the video, please leave a comment and uh, a like, and also subscribe to the channel and check out my previously recommended videos. Uh-huh. I will see you guys on stream, all right? Thank you so much for watching. Mwah!